Hello crafty friends, my name's Alicia, but you can call me Crafty Owl. And welcome, or perhaps welcome back, to my channel. I'm here today to announce the lucky winner of a recent challenge here on my channel. Each month I get together with my die cut and paper trimmer level members for a little crafty live. The theme varies from month to month, but there's usually a challenge and a possibility to win a prize. If you want to find out more about the perks of channel membership, including those monthly lives, make sure to check out the join button below this video or the link down in the description box. Not only do my channel members keep me creating here on YouTube, but they also help keep the sheet load of cards free for all subscribers. If you're interested in supporting me, if you just love sheet load of cards and the rest of my videos, I hope you'll check that out. For the June 2024 channel member live, we did choose your own adventure card making edition, and it's where we follow a path. And at each stop, we make a decision what our project will include. Up on screen now is a look at the June 2024 path. So as I show you the cards here in just a minute, you'll kind of understand where the members were coming from when they created theirs. I made my card during the live, but members did have a couple days to make theirs and get them entered into the giveaway. And speaking of my card, why don't we go ahead and take a look at it? Up on screen now is a look at the path that I chose for the evening's festivities. And here is a look at the teeny tiny shaped card I made using that path. Let's go ahead and take a look at what my channel members created. Weren't all of those so fun? I love seeing how those different options can get different cards and what people choose. Now, before we announce the winner, let me show you what they get to choose from for this month's prizes. I pulled a few prize options from my treasure box. All of them happen to be from Tailored Expressions this month, and the winner will get to choose which one they would like me to send them. In the center here is the rainbow bright die. You can make your own colorful cards. Over on the right is Tailored Expressions framed flower stamp set. And then finally over here on the left is one of their brand new Happy Half Sheet Volume 1 sets. I have been sharing about these last week. They are super fun. It's five laminated cards that if you stamp a half sheet of cardstock, it gives you some cutting dimensions and shows you how to make usually between four and five cards with just that one stamped half sheet. Now, I do have videos using this, so I will link that playlist below, but let's go ahead and take a quick look at those so you get a better idea of what you create with the cards. My first set of cards is actually shared over on the Tailored Expressions channel. And here's a look at the half sheet that I used to create these. And I started out with this single stamped half sheet of cardstock, and I created these four cards. Now, just like with sheet load of cards, you can definitely dress these up and make them your own. For instance, I added some glittery gems and a die cut and popped up flower. The second set I created was a live stream that I did on Monday, and this is the card I used. And from a single stamped half sheet, I was able to get these five cards. Once again, I kind of made them my own. I added some cardstock strips and some cardstock mats, along with a little circle of vellum behind my sentiment to help it stand out. 
Now, while I was doing this live, I talked about how you don't have to stamp your own cardstock to use these. You could also use pattern paper. And many of you are interested in seeing that, so I did come back with another live stream to make another set. For my third set, I went through and I picked out some large scraps of pattern paper I had left over here in my stash, and the live viewers got to decide which pattern that I would use, and they also got to vote which happy half sheet I would use. For this live stream, I did open up the happy half sheets of volume two, and this was the one that they voted on to have me create with. This half sheet or eight and a half by five and a half piece of pattern paper created these four cards. You know that I love sketch and mass producing cards, so I did fall in love with these happy half sheets. If you do want to find out more about the happy half sheets, I do have some links down below in the related product section. Now let's go ahead and find out who won June's challenge. Thanks to everyone who took the time to play along with the challenge and congratulations again to the winner. I will be in touch shortly to find out which of the prizes you would like to receive. Until my next video, I hope you're all having a crafty day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch all the way to the end of the video. I hope now you'll consider clicking on one of the videos or playlists I have linked above. And if you are interested in any of the products or tools I used in today's video, I do have some links in the description box below.